One of the lies we have been told, we have believed in church, is that only a, only a specific and special people are able to pray in the spirit. Now, I'm saying pray in the spirit. There's prayer in the spirit and there's prayer in tongues. Now, tongues is a gift of a spirit which only the Holy Spirit gives to people. And whoever prays in tongues needs another gift, which is the, the gift of interpretation of tongues to explain what that person prayed in. But every believer, any man, woman, child, adult that believes in the name of Jesus will be able to pray in the Spirit. And you see a lot of believers getting confused over this. See, when you find yourself in any church, and for some reason, that church has people who are able to pray in the Spirit. Join them. Join them. You go to you find out you go to a lot of churches and you realize when people for some reason who are able to pray in the spirit are praying in the spirit other believers just disconnect themselves from them they sideline themselves from them and they isolate themselves that's why it's, it's we are even struggling to pray in the spirit you should desire it you should yearn it because prayer in the spirit it, it, it comes with a lot of benefits i'm telling you I've prayed in the normal words, and that one you have to think about it. You have to construct the sentences you are about to say and all that. And in praying with the normal words, you can't go, you can't cross a certain threshold. I mean, the ones who are trying very much in praying in normal words, using, using a normal language, the farthest you can go is one hour. But if you yearn and desire to pray in the spirit, once 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 you once you're able to break through in praying in the spirit you'll be able to pray for longer hours you'll be able to pray for four hours you'll be able to pray for five hours you'll be able to pray for six seven eight hours non-stop why because prayer in the spirit you're not praying to man you're praying to god and everything you're praying what everything that your spirit is praying and asking about we are speaking mysteries not unto men and even that process the Bible tells, tells you that what it edifies your, your it, it edifies you, it strengthens you, it encourages you, it charges you up to go further. And the reason why believers are not going, are not even are not able to pray for long hours is with some of these misconceptions in our minds that it's a special group of people who pray in the spirit. There's prayer in the spirit and prayer in tongues. There's prayer in the spirit and prayer in tongues. I'll do a part two of this one. Watch that one.